And, and this is Adam Rakoff. Adam Rakoff is, is the, the man who produced the Full Metal Jacket Diary iPad app. Um, it's, a, it's an extraordinarily deeply immersive uh, experience that, that, that you wouldn't normally have with uh, any kind of book or audio book. That this is a, something quite extraordinary and, and Al Adam was the producer of the, of the app. And you met him at an, at an Apple store? Yeah, Adam used to work for Apple Computer and uh, they used to do these, these talks called Made on a Mac. And Adam invited me to come and speak uh, and present my book, The Full Metal Jacket Diary. Uh, to, to the audience because it was it was made on a Mac. It was designed on a on a Mac. So um, yeah, and it was Adam's idea then to take the book and to uh, create something that had never been created before. To create something that was, as I say, deeply immersive and, uh, and kind of let's call it a 3D experience with a book. Cinematic experience. A cinematic experience. Yeah. 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 And now back to Adam. <laughs> Yeah, we did everything on the Macintosh computer um, and, of course, using the iOS um, develop, developer tools to program the application for, uh, exclusively for the iPad. Uh, and how much does the uh, app cost? The app costs $9.99 and is over four hours in length in terms of the audio and the content that you're getting. But because a lot of people are hesitant to pay $9.99 for an app, We've, are, we've begun to offer a free preview of the first chapter on iTunes. So if you search for Full Metal Jacket Diary, you'll actually f find two different applications. One is the full version for $9.99, and one is a free preview of the first chapter. So you can sample it and really get a taste of what you're going to be buying. Now, is this compatible, backward compatible with all the iPads, uh, starting from the original one? It does. It works with the original iPad. It was optimized for the newer iPads with the Retina display, so the photographs that we scanned look much crisper and sharper on the Retina screens. So it will work uh, on any iPad.